Hey there guys, OGM here, welcome you to One-Offs, the series where when a man asks you to play with his balls, it's not an HR issue. Everyone, welcome to Balls 3D. Yes guys, balls. What is balls? Well, let me tell you, balls is balls. Balls is balls, yes guys. Uh, this is a fighting game. And what else can I say besides that? First off, we have characters Kronk, Boomer, Bruiser, Turbo, Tsunami, Yoko, Divine, Crusher, Kronk. Now, each character, again, this is a fighting game. I cannot stress that enough. This is a fighting game. Each character has their own status. Better attack, better defense, better aerial attack, and on and on and on. We can get into that, but... Kronk came up first, so Kronk it is. Let's Kronk it out, guys. Kronk, okay, we're going right into it. So what I was going to try and say is this is a fighting game. You guys can see your health at the very top of the screen. You can jump. You can kick. You can punch, or in my case, club. Also, pay no attention to the background because things? Yeah. It's also worth noting, too, because it's a fighting game, there are combos that you can do, and I'm losing here really bad right now because I'm not really trying to show things off. I'm just playing. But regardless, there are combos. Make sure that you use them to your advantage because, like, you know, moving back, just like Street Fighter, oh yeah, it does stuff. So, like, back, 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 duke, that does stuff. And then you can jump. Oh no, he's gonna throw me! No, get out of there, Kronk! Oh no. But yes, this game. Oh no, I'm dizzy. It's also, if you guys can't tell from the title, Balls 3D. It's 3D. This fighting game is nuts because of the simple fact that you can... Oh, he's dizzy. Because of the simple fact that you can move around the battlefield. And also, he's begging. Begging is another thing, too, we need to get into. But there's just so much. Also, victory animations. Oh, boy. When you guys do victory animations, it gets funny. Because each character does something different. There are some characters that play with the balls. Hence the whole entire intro. There are other characters that just don't care. But there is so much to explain. So much little to explain because it's a fighting game and everyone knows if you've ever played Street Fighter, there are so many different rules and regulations that you can make here. Get him! Get him! Boink! He's out of there. But yeah, guys, there's just so much. I love it. But yeah, the point is, if you guys have never played a fighting game, don't spam. Try and learn your combos because some combos are actually pretty solid. Like this one right here. The leap that I'm about to do, if I can actually do it right. Oh, come on. I'm trying to... It's a low sweep if you guys want to know. So Kronk, actually, I think I've done it a couple times already. There it was. I just did it for a second there. But Kronk has a leap, and that leap is crazy. It can actually stun your enemy where they go, doo -doo, doo -doo, doo -doo, like almost like a cuckoo clock. Also, like I said, begging, you guys might have seen it. Whenever you reach three balls, which he's under now, you can actually beg, and it will heal your character. Oh, come on, 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 doink. And also, if you push all your moves... It taunts them. You just saw I slapped my butt. The problem is, when you do that, and you guys just saw it, my health dropped like a rock. So you can do double damage for your next hit. But also, if you get hit, it's double damage against you. So it's a two-edged sword. Very good, but very danger. Also, this dude right here just ate my balls. He literally just shoved his balls, or my balls, in his mouth. Look at, look at that. He is eating my balls. Like I said, these victory animations are nuts. And let me tell you, some of them get even crazier. But there we go. Enough explaining, because I'm pretty sure I've about covered all I can without really covering all that I can. Let's be honest here. Uh, I will say one of Kronk's things is if you guys can actually get the enemy in the air, like how he's jumping around a lot, hit them with your club while they're in the air. Kronk does massive amounts of damage like that. Just saying. So if you can, do it. I just love the background. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. I love it so much. It's so ridiculous. But yeah, it's all about combos. It's a fighting game. It's fun. It's silly. I love it. So, I have to say, this game holds a special place in my heart. Not because, oh, it's on his emulator. I already know it. He's going to say the same story. No, it's not, you jerks. Yeah, can you guys tell we've talked about this on stream a couple times? You jerks. No, the reason why this game is actually special to me is because of one simple thing. So... Back in the day, you guys may or may not know, I didn't have a whole lot of money growing up as a child. I was actually one of the poor kids. Like, oh, woe is me. Uh, every YouTuber, poor kid, came from nothing. No, I'm not going into all that. 
But what I am going to say here is I was a poor child. However, one of my favorite things to do was back in the day, you could actually get coupons to Chuck E. Cheese. You would get like a pizza and you would be able to get a uh, uh, like 20 tokens for like, I don't know, 10 bucks or something. Again, it was the 90s. You could do it. It was great. Either way, though, it was a large pizza and tokens and a pop or we would just bring our own pop or whatever. I don't remember exactly. But the point is... It had a th Oh, there's your instant replay if you want to watch it. We don't care. But it had a thing, which is nice. And that thing was just amazing for me. Because I could go to Chuck E. Cheese, play some games, get some pizza. All because of the sale that they'd put in the newspaper. Yay, Chuck E. Cheese. Anyway, with that being said, one of the prizes that I got was actually an emulator. Oh, I thought it wasn't about emulators. No, it wasn't about my emulator. This was like arcade games or something, arcade jams or something like I don't remember what it was exactly called. However, this game right here, Balls, was on it. And it was the very first fighting game I actually ever played. Like most people are like, oh, I played Street Fighter for my first fighting game. I'm cool. No, legit, this game right here was my first fighting game ever. And this game is hard. Like it actually has three difficult settings. It has easy, medium, and hard, obviously. But even on easy, this game gets difficult fast. It ramps up super fast. And the bosses in this game, because yes, there are bosses, the bosses in this game are broken. Like one of the, I think the very first boss in this game, it's an ostrich. And that ostrich is stupid, dude. It is messed up. However, this is how I actually learned to love fighting games. You might be like, oh, well, I grew up on Smash Brothers or whatever. No, I legit grew up on this game. A messed up 3D ball game, and it is silly, and I love it, and legit. I've talked to a lot of people that like fighting games, and not a lot of people know this game. Now, some hardcore people do, don't get me wrong. But a lot of people I've talked to, when I ever mention balls, they're like, yeah, what now? This is, what? And then I show them this game, and they're like, excuse me? It's nuts. But either way, though, this game means a lot to me, because it's my very first fighter, and it's just it's beautiful. I have to say, I think my favorite character that I did was either Kronk, because I played a lot of Kronk, because he was always the first character, and me being a stupid kid, I was like, wait a minute, you can pick different characters? But it's probably Kronk, uh, oh, what's, th is it Perfection, I think is her name? And yes, you heard me correctly, her name, because you know, more than just men have balls, just saying. But yes, Perfection, I believe is her name. I played a lot of the clown, well, not a lot of the clown, the clown was always my irritation as a child, because he'd always beat the crap out of me. But it was Kronk Perfection, and I believe it was Rhino was the other guy's name, I think. Let's see here if I can find any one of them. Oh, look, there's another guy. Another fighter, perhaps. Yes. Kiss. I saw Kiss. Was it Kiss the Mat? I think it says Kiss the Mat or something. Dude, this guy keeps trying to grab me, man. He is on it. Oh, man. I need to get some combos on this guy or it's going to be rough. Get out of here, buddy. Oh, come on. So, what I'm trying to do here is, I, I believe it's Kronk that has it. It's been a while since I've played the game. Kronk actually has, like, a boomerang thing that he can do with his little club. I believe he just straight up tosses it, and it's one of his jump combos. But he tosses his club, it goes right through him, comes back. Unfortunately, though, whenever you throw it, you're very, very vulnerable. So, you got to be very careful whenever you throw your club, because if you guys can't tell, Kronk is all about his club. Oh, he's begging. He's trying to heal. No, no. No healing. Oh, geez. He got that one better than I did. I'd love to get that jump here and just stun him and call it a day. Oh, no! Get out of there, Kronk. Get out of there, Kronk. Oh, geez. Poor Kronk. Oh, no! Oh. Oh. If a loss... Wow. If a loss were brains, you would be a genius. Oh, I love how sassy some of these are. They're so funny. Also, he's kicking my balls. How dare you kick my balls, sir? Get out of here. Don't kick my... Oh, okay. Well, he had a little pebble that he just kicked there. That was fun. Get out of here, dude. If I remember correctly, this guy, for obvious reasons, is uh, one of the stronger characters. Yeah, there it is. There it is. So you guys saw how like he did that whole entire like little pile driver thing where like he grabbed me, put me into the ground, and then like he just let me die. That's basically what mine just was there with Kronk, where I just beat him over the head. It's a grab that Kronk can do. Instead of doing the baseball launch, he just puts him into the ground and then just clubs them to death. It's a very good move, but it's a very... Oh, jeez. It's a very long combo. Also, if you guys can't tell how much faster some of these enemies get, the farther you get. It's nuts. Continues left. Oof. I've already died. 
Now, here's the thing, though. I don't... Oh, well, I guess I have to. I was going to say, I'd really rather not continue, because I'd like to swap my character to show off more characters. But I guess it's okay. Doink, 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 doink. Boink! Bye! You guys saw how much damos that did. It's pretty good. Oh, come on. I know it's... It's the jump... Ah, yes! Another one of Kronk's. I love that about Kronk, too. You can get behind him, and if you get behind him, it is stupid. So good. Come on, Kronk. Get out of there. Get out of there. Come on, Kronk. Get out of there. Uh, go, buddy. Go. Doink. Beautiful. No. Oh, I hit the screen. Rude. Ugh. So rude. Yeah, bonk. Dude, I love it. There's not really much to say. It's a fighting game. I mean, what can you say? But it's, it's so silly. So silly. I love it. Oh, no. I'm stunned. Get out of there, Kronk. Goodbye. Doink. I love the baseball in the background. That was perfect timing. Dude, that was legit. I love that. Come on, Kronk. No! Dang. I thought I was going to have it. I really thought I was going to have it. Nope. That's it. That's game. Yep. There I go. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, <laughs> bug eye. Rude? Rude. Rude. No genie. Oh. Is there a way to go out? Nope. You just got to go to the next match. Okay. Well, poopy. Maybe I should have just made it one match. I was trying to do like a fair fighting where it was like two to or two out of three, but it, eh, it don't matter. It's just me versus a computer after all. Maybe I should just set that up for the next one. It's fine. Kick the mat, chump. You don't know my life. Get out of here. Open wide for that one. Smell that mat. Lick that mat, chump. Nibble some aruga. Kiss the canvas. I just, I'm reading the background. I'm not even paying attention to the fighting. It's fine. Hope you don't hurl. So ridiculous. Oh, man, I did the jump on that one. Had I actually got the jump, that would have been amazing. Also, I'm wondering if I should just go... Okay, well, it doesn't matter now. I was going to say, I'm wondering if I should just go all out and just do taunt, 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 but meh. I'm wondering if I just let this sit here for a second. Can I just go back to the main menu, please? Because if I can go back to the main menu, that'd be preferred. Hmm. Maybe not. Yeah, maybe not. All right. Well, poopy. I guess we keep going then. Let's go, Kronk. I will go ahead and after I... Well, actually, do I even care to fight anymore? Because I want to show off other characters. You know what? Here. Here. I'll taunt so I take double demos. All right, there. I'm just going to keep taunting. Keep taunting. That way I take double demos whenever I get up. There it is. Perfect. Take some more double demos. More double demos. Kill me, buddy. How hard is it for you to kill? Oh, he's going to show off. He's going to throw me. Bye. Oh, or not. Kerchunkles. Oh, well. Cool. One down. One to go. Keep killing me. Keep killing me. But yeah, I definitely need to go back to the main menu. I need to reset stuff that way. I Well, for one, I'm going to reset the matches. Because if I reset the matches, that'll help out a lot. And then, I guess the difficult... Um, nah, nah. I'm not too worried about the difficulty. Whatever the difficulty's on now, I'll just keep it as. If it's normal or easy or hard, I don't know what it is on right now. But I'll just keep it as that. Either way, though, here we go. Throw me and explode me. Oh, you know what I could do, actually? Here, let me let me uh, get beaten up a lot here, and let me actually beg. I don't know if he's going to let me beg because, you know, I am pretty far in there right now, but we'll see what happens. Come here, mess up Kronk. And around and around and around she goes, getting thrown. Well, rip me, I guess. Kill me. Kill me. Murder my life. All right. Come on, a little bit more. A little bit more, and then I can... Be oh, I'm dizzy. A little bit more. Little, uh, there it is. Now I can beg. Okay, here we go. Oh, no. Oh, he's not going to let me do it, is he? No, he's not going to let me do it. Oh, jeez. Well, I was going to try and beg. Basically, if you tap down three times in a row in rapid succession, just do-do-do. You'll actually begin begging, and like I've already said, too, when you beg, it actually allows you to heal. And unfortunately, I don't think he's going to let me do that. All right, perfect. He's going to get a throw on me. Which is actually kind of cool, because I've overpowered everyone on the throws. Because I'm just a faster typer. Or ty a typer? No, tapper. Beautiful. Also, he got a lot of damage on me on that one. Jeez. Alright, hit me. Throw me. Kill me. There it is. And... 
Kaboom. Beautiful. How many more do I got? Two continues left. Oh my gosh. How many more? wonder if that actually is something you can edit in the uh, the settings. I hope it is, because, man, this is going to take a while if it's not. Kapow! All right. Kill me. Murder me. I'm going to jump in your arms, buddy. I'm jumping into your arms. I'm not even putting up a fight. Just murder, please. Oh, that'll hurt. Nice. Nice. All right. There we go. Begging again. Let's see if I can beg. Oh, well, he grabbed me, so it's not going to matter. Okay, bye. Jeez. Okay, cool. How many more? I don't even know how... Oh, jeez. That was zero of one still. This sucks. In case you guys wanted to know, this sucks. So, everyone, while I wait for myself to get beaten up here again, how are you doing today? I apologize that I didn't adjust the settings originally because I expected that I would just be able to swap my character, but I cannot because, again, I haven't played this for a while. But still, either way, though, how are you guys doing today? Are you guys doing well? Were you expecting me to play with my balls online in front of, you know, all of you people? Hundreds, thousands, millions of online viewers? No. People think when you're playing with your balls online, it's a whole other thing. No, this is a family-friendly channel. When I play with my balls, I play with them so everyone has a fair chance. It's That's just what type of person I am. Everyone has a fair chance to judge me for playing with my balls. Everyone can judge me for how much... I don't play with my balls appropriately. You thought that I was playing with my balls, right? No. I am a full-fledged adult, and I don't know how to play with my balls. Just let that sink in. Boys, remember, you may be going through puberty, and you may be, you know, developing in some special ways, because, you know, puberty is a thing. However, guess what? You don't know how to play with your balls, and neither do I. And look how old I am. I'm 30. I'm ancient on the internet. I might as well be dead, like three feet in the coffin. Not just one foot, not even two, but I'm like five. I am five feet under right now. I'm not the full ten yet because I'm not like a full-fledged adult. There's still like a whole life that I have to live. But still, uh, here I am, and I am still learning how to play with my balls. That's the whole point here. Sir, can you murder me? Thank you. I'm okay. You are flexing. That would have been great. Oh, he's flexing again. Oh, he just keeps flexing. He's just gonna make this a horrible, horrible, horrible thing. Go for the double damage. It's Raz time. Game over. Beautiful. Cool. All right, let's go to the options here. What do we got? Oh, apparently it was on easy. Whatever. It doesn't matter. There we go. One of one. That's what I want. I don't need any handicap. Oh, I guess all those continues are just standard. Huh. Okay. Cool. Whatever. Either way, though. Back to it. We did Kronk. We got Boomer, like I said, one of my okay ones. Bruiser, who we just got the crap beaten out of us with. Turbo, who we beat the crap out of. Tsunami, yet again. I've already read all these names, so it doesn't really matter. There she is. Divine. Yes, that's what I was saying. Balls are not just for boys, everyone. Balls are for girls, too. And Crush, it's not Rhino, it's Crusher. He is a Rhino. There we go. All right, either way, though, let's try Divine. I know that she's very silly. And if I remember correctly, her victory taunt is actually a little crazy because she, if I remember correctly, I think she plays with your balls. And I don't... Okay, so let's see if I actually remember this. So, the clown... Oh yeah, I forgot she spanks them. That's amazing. I completely forgot that she spanks them. That's so legit. I love that. Anyway, the clown, he juggles your balls... I think Rhino might, or no, no, the monkey dude eats your balls. I was going to say, I think Rhino eats your balls, but no, I think Rhino just like punch your balls like it's nothing. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Oh, well, either way, though, get out of here. Boom. Love that. I love her throw. Whole flip over that. Smell that, Matt. It smells delicious. All right. Get out of here, madam. Mad oh, geez, he's spitting. Oh, yeah, that's right. You better beg. Beg for me, boys. Oh. Oh, I'm about to eat his face. All right, let's see what she does. I don't remember. Oh, here we go. No, oh, she's just kissing. Come on. Doesn't she do something with the balls? I thought she did something with the balls. Do you not do anything with the balls? Was I wrong? Oh, no. There we go. Wait, did she just take off her balls? It's a bubble? I think it was a I think she like blew a piece of bubble gum or something. I don't know. Whatever. Either way though, perfection. 
Beautiful. Love it. Continuing on. Wait, what? Excuse me. Why did it not... It said 0-1, didn't it? Pretty sure that said 0-1. Also, it, it would have had to. Why am I fighting this guy still? It wouldn't matter. Get out of here, dude. Why am I fighting you? I shouldn't be fighting you at all. Why am I fighting this guy? Whatever. I guess it doesn't matter, but still. I was trying to show off more characters. All right, just keep sucking his soul out of his neck. I'm actually a vampire. Hooray. Nibble, nibble. Nibble, nibble. I forgot how high she jumped. She's crazy, dude. And there we go. I'm sucking him clean. And he just goes explosion. Instant replay. Kronk. Oh, buddy. Kronk. I'm sorry, man. I just I have to do this. I forgot that she sucks them so much. And so much of their health comes out if you tap it fast enough. It is insane. I remember she was a jumper, but I forgot how much of a jumper she is. Yeah, look at this. Watch his health, man. His health just goes. So good. Wait, Kronk can sp I don't remember Kronk spitting. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Excuse me. No, no, Kronk. No, no. Okay, I guess we're just going to keep sucking. Suck him like there's nothing left, and now I get... Oh, I'm about to die. Oh, no! Kronk! Well, everyone, if you see, if you actually know how to play the game, that's what a real Kronk player looks like right there. He beats the crap out of you just like I, uh, he did. It's fine. Jeez. There we go. Do the flip. Do the flippers. The flip skarooskies. Now, one thing I know I mentioned already with Kronk is Kronk actually has an ability that uh, jumping attacks don't have a whole lot to him. Like, he's just got really good defense for aerial attacks. So the whole entire sucking mechanic that she can do actually doesn't do a lot for Kronk. So there is that. If you guys are, like, trying to be like, oh, just keep jumping on his back. It's fine. No, actually, that doesn't matter for Kronk, unfortunately. Kronk's also very short, so I keep, like, punching over him, it looks like. All right, come here, Kronk. I know it doesn't really count that way, but it just it looks like that, if you ask me. Oh, oh, there we go. Spank him. Spank that boy. Spank that boy. You know you know what they say? Uh, get out of here, caveman! Ah! Spank that boy. Spank him now. Get out of here. Yeah, there we go. Blow up my balls. Bounce it up. And... Pop. Beautiful. Cool. Wait, did I say one of Oh, yeah, because Kronk just beat me in the last one. Huh. But I don't understand. It said... I, hmm, I could have sworn I changed it. I could have sworn I changed it, but it's whatever. I guess it doesn't matter, but still. It's fine. Everything's fine. Hello, Kronk. Eat my shoe. Yeah, look at that. Beautiful. I love it. See, guys, I give a little bit of diversity here. I give uh, some diversity to the cave. Oh, Kronk was just praying there. He was begging for his mercy. I saw that. He was on all fours. Anyway, you have Kronk, who's representing all the boys and their dinosaur love. And then you have all the ladies here with our beauty, grace, and mess up this whole place. Tsunami! Hello, sir! Oh, Tsunami? What was Tsunami's? Oh, I don't remember what Tsunami's victory was. Oh, I completely forgot what that one is. Kind of curious now. Huh. I guess it doesn't matter, though. We'll figure it out. I know that Tsunami, though, is extremely defensive. So he can take a lot of demos. But I think that he's actually weak to Ariel. So someone like her is huge if you can get a bunch of, like, the sucking move on him and whatnot. Also, he's very fast. For being a sumo, he's very fast. Come here, Tsunami. Goodbye. Oh, oh, man, I thought I had it. I really thought I had it. Oh, there it is. Sweet. I am the best at playing with my balls. Because you know what? What better way to play with balls than as a caveman playing baseball and a woman blowing up bubbles? Beautiful, right? Beautiful. Get spanked, son. Get spanked. Spunk a dude, and I do mean you. Oh, come on. I'm trying to pick him up and throw him, but I can't get close enough because every time I get closer, I have to keep jumping because he keeps going. There it is. That's what I wanted right there. Yeah, beautiful. All right, I'll suck you again, sir. You want me to suck you? I'll suck you. Don't think I won't. I'm an expert sucker. Boom. All right, just for fun. Oh, I was going to taunt now. Oh, I was going to get cocky. I admit to it, I was going to get cocky. It's fine. All right, what do we got now? 
Oh no, there's the boss. Oh, I wasn't expecting to get to the boss with her. Oh, that's awkward. Okay, well, like I said, this guy gets stupid. But we are playing on easy, apparently, so maybe it won't be as bad as I was expecting. But here we go. We're going to see what... No! Whoa! Oh, he's taunting. That's his taunt. I forgot about that. Oh my gosh, he throws so much. Stop throwing me. I don't want to die. Taunt the ostrich. Okay, fine. I'll taunt the ostrich. Don't think I won't. Oh, dang. I'm trying to get in there and taunt. It said taunt. I was trying. I was trying to taunt him. No! There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Do you see that? Look at that dance. Look at that dance. Look at her. She is dancing. It's also worth noting, too, the longer that you taunt, like the more consecutive taunts that you do, the, uh, I believe the stronger the hit is. So it's like times one, times two, times so, and on and on and on. If I remember correctly. But either way, though, I'm dancing. I was dancing. Cool. I think it caps at times four demos. I think. I could be wrong, but I think that's how it is. All right. Here we go. Mr. Ostrich. Mr. The Stritch. I wonder if that's when you're supposed to taunt for him. You're supposed to get yourself stronger when he's in the ground because he's taunting back. Maybe that's what it was. I don't remember. I remember there's a trick to his fight, though. Oh, he's wiggling his butt. Did you see that butt wiggle? That's rude. That's a rude boy. Oh, no. I'm going to run out of time, aren't I? I just realized. It's probably been already like 60 seconds, and I think each match is like 90. Oh, sad. Look at that. Look at that taunt. He's just bouncing there. He's like, ha-ha. 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 I really was not expecting to fight the ostrich, though. Like, legit. All right, hold on a minute. Let's go ahead and just get our taunt in here. Why not? If we get a taunt in, it's good. So there we go. Cool. Let's do another one. There we go. Get another one. Beautiful. Can I get another one? Just for fun. Shake my butt. One more. One more. Yeah, there we go. Butt wiggles for days. All right, let's do this. Doink. Yeah, do you guys just see how much health he just lost? That's what I was talking about. If you guys didn't see that, go ahead and rewind the video. Unfortunately, though, he's healing. All right, let's see if I can do that again. So there we go. Okay, hold on. Let's see if I can do that again. There's two. Yeah, do you guys just see that, how messed up that is? The taunt destroys if you do it right. And I told you, I knew there was a way to cheese him. I just had to remember what it was. I completely forgot what his whole entire cheesing method was. All right, there we go. So now we do it again. You wiggle your butt, and then you wiggle your butt. I bet you guys didn't expect this to be able to be cheese like this, did you? Because guess what? It can be. And this is the first boss of the game. If you try to fight him regularly, you get destroyed. All right, I think that should be okay. Yeah, there it was. Ha ha. Boom. Get messed up up son but again it is very very risky because if you do that and you get hit you just saw i one punch that guy and he died very risky though all right anyway continuing on the red belt oh yes i am now the red belt also cutscenes in this game too i forgot about that i really did forget about that but there we go there's the master of the game fun fact when you first turn on the game he's like uh you are a failure I think that I can beat you. Oh, Rhino, hi. But also, we've now changed colors, too, which is pretty cool. Get out of here, Rhino, or Crasher, whatever your name is. But it's okay. If he beats me, then I can actually show off what his thing is, which is pretty fun. I guess, okay. Or right, I was going to say, yeah, I'm just going to keep sucking him till he dies. Apparently not. I also find it funny, too, that, you know, the, oh, geez. Get out of here, dude. I just picked up a rhino. How many people can say they can pick up a rhino like that? No one, but I can give spankings. Get spunked and get sucked. Yeah. Out of here. Shattered Raz time and so much more. I love it. Do I change bubblegum colors? I don't remember. I'm actually kind of curious if I change bubblegum colors. Because I remember I changed outfit colors, but just that was about it. Do I change bubblegum? Bubblegum, bubblegum in a dish. How many pieces do you wish? Hopefully different color ones, question mark. Of course, is she not going to do it now? Oh, madam, are you going to give me some colors, or are you just going to flash your K on your your uh, outfit there, I guess? I don't know. Yeah, it's fine. Whatever. Continuing on. 
get crushed. Lick the mat, chump. Yeah, that's right, chump. Lick that mat and get thrown. Like I said, back in the day, if you guys can't tell, I played this game a lot, and she was one of my tops. Her and uh, Kronk, and then like I said, I'm pretty sure this Rhino dude. And I tried to play the clown a little bit, but the clown was a little difficult for me. I was never too good at him. But there we go. If you guys can't tell, I know their moves. At least a little bit better than I do anyone else. That's probably the best way to say it. I know their moves better than anyone else. Five down, eight to go. Let's go again, baby. Oh, here we go. Boomer the Clown. You know what? If I lose to Boomer, I can actually show what it is. But if I don't lose to Boomer, I can keep going. Which I'm also kind of tempted to do. I'd rather keep going than lose. Get clowned on, son. Now, if I remember correctly, Boomer actually has an ability that's really scary. Like, he can take off his arm or something. Like, do super stretch. He does, like, something really stupid, or, like, there's fire or something he does. And I remember messed me up a lot as a kid, and I'd always lose to Boomer whenever I'd find him as the computer. I don't remember what it is, though. I really don't remember what the move was. Oh, well. I guess it doesn't really matter as long as I beat him, but still. I just wish I could tell you, be like, oh, yeah, I'm an expert at this game. He does this and this and this, and you're done. But I'm not that good. Either Oh, that's what it was. The head. Haha. -ha. I knew there was, like, a stretchy move. I knew there was. Well, I'm not crazy, though. Also, that little clown horn. Oh, what was that? A ground pound? I forgot about that one. Oh, jeez. Now, remember when I said I was going to lose to him? Yeah, look at my health versus his health. This is where we all fall apart. Alright, get out of here, son. He also taunted me there, by the way. That whole entire little explosion thing that he did, and he rearranged his body parts. That's his taunt. Because he's a clown, and he's funny. He's a funny clown man. He he ho ho. Oh, I forgot. Oh, that's his throw. I hate this game. He's really... What a jerk. Well, there you go. Now you can actually watch him juggle my balls. He's he's using red, which means he might be using my breasts. You are disgusting, sir. Pick up your balls from all around. Make me sad and juggle the town. Guys... This has been Balls 3D. Go tell HR that you watch Balls on the Clock because, man, oh, man, we've got to have to have a conversation with you, aren't you? We are definitely going to have to have a conversation with you for watching Balls in a public space and playing with Balls in a public space. And I'm playing with Balls in front of all of you. Congratulations. If you guys like this, then please like, comment, subscribe, and until next time, OGM signing out.